Hello everybody, this is Shannon with Baja Racing Gear with a programming tip for the QYT 780 Plus. So if you went the extra step and you bought the software or the uh, the cable and got the software, uh, you want to definitely pay attention to this. So what happens here is, uh, let's say you have uh, all your, you went through all that time and you programmed all your channels in there and you got your channel names and stuff and you um, program the radio. Well, the radio is fine, it's happy. Well, the next day you go in there and say, oh shoot, I forgot to add another channel. Uh, so you go in and you read the contents from the radio. What happens when you read it, as you will see, uh, in the wide narrow column, it will randomly change them to wide, okay? And in the scan add, the scan on or off, uh, it'll randomly, that same exact column that it changed to Y will change that to off. Well, it's not a problem at this moment because obviously the radio still has the same data. But if I was not to pay attention to that and I were to type in a new channel into there and uh, write to the radio, it will actually save those changes uh, for the wide narrow and the scan uh, channel on or off. So you really have to pay attention. So basically when you read it, you have to add your channel and then go back and switch all of these to a, a narrow uh, uh, or whichever choice you had, assuming it's gonna be narrow. And if you wanted them to scan, you gotta change them all back to on and then you have to write the contents back to the radio and the radio is happy. I have forwarded this error over to QIT uh, hopefully they will fix this and, and send out a new release. Uh, that's all I have. Thank you.